What's up guys? Welcome back to The Witcher 3. Now, what we are going to do here is we're going to... Oh gosh, I forgot my controller battery so low. I may have to quickly cut out the stream later, like I'll... Like, I might have to leave and then come right back. I'm just gonna do some irrigation. Won't take too long. Sir, sir, a letter for you, sir. Letter? Who from? Can't rightly say, sir. I was just to deliver it. Here's your tip. Here, and thanks. No, sir. Thank you! And I truly hope I'll be off surface again. That's another act done. Dearest. I suspect weighty affairs, rather than merely the wine festival, have drawn you to Tucson. Perhaps you'll find time to probe a certain matter in spite of this. I recently came across the mention of one Professor Moreau, a scholar in Beauclair. Who conducted research into Witcher mutations. Though the details are rather murky, as is the location of the scholar's laboratory, his journal could contain more information. It lies buried with him in his tomb. I enclose a map I found in the book I happened upon. Though less than completely legible, I trust it will prove useful nonetheless. Mm. I felt this matter could prove of some importance to you, thus I dispatched this letter without delay. Whatever you decide, please take exceedingly good care of yourself. Your Yen. Hmm. A professor who studied Witcher mutations might actually be worth looking into. There we go. You can only be one. We we done two of those. So we just got valor, honor, and wisdom. Ah oh, crap, I am stuck. Geralt! Damn. Oh, there we go. Phew! The Geralt was stuck. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> oh, this must be the tavern. Or not. This is the tavern. A smashing place we have, eh? No. Wine by the bell. Peace and quiet. Love things. Okay. I just know that, uh, we go back to here. The grounds. Pretty sure there's a quest here. At that medical tent. So we're gonna head there. I'm my own master with the bottle. Right, there'd be like a road sign around. Fair folk. It's recommended you stay in your home. Infamory. Isn't this place so nice? There we go, this is exactly what we're looking for. Now these. A two-shawl official who doles out rewards for contracts. Sweet. And there's a barber. I've still been thinking about cut cutting Geralt's hair. Do you guys think I should give Geralt a haircut? I don't know. The barber's right here, so let's just have a look at the options, I guess. Oh, ding. Oh, my ding. 
Of course, he's like he's kind of like Italian, of course. Welcome, my good sir. Need a bit no, of not really. In mind. Let's see. Here, yeah. <laughs> I could play Grint with him. I right, just just remember, for some reason, like you can grow it all back by just paying again. Loose not too long. Let's have a look. Now that doesn't actually look that bad on Geralt. Makes him look like Dante. Actually, I think we'll stick My with that. My time's up. So long. Geralt, you're actually not looking half bad. I'm gonna stick with it. Now, find that medical tent. I'm gonna say it's gonna be next to all these. Oh, I didn't realize he's got the armory one here too. That would have been useful. Oh, yeah, there he is. Emergency and import. I must speak to you. Okay. Now I am just gonna quickly bring up that YouTube video just so I make sure I do this right. Your wound feeling better? It's healing splendidly, though I am to avoid trouble for some time. To be frank, that is precisely why I wish to speak with you. Want me to stand in for you? Take on some trouble on your behalf? That could very well be the case. You see, there is a maiden, nay, a lady. I suspect someone's cast an ill spell upon her. A curse, perhaps. What makes you think she might be cursed? You must keep all I say to yourself, I beg you. I would never dare to be so indiscreet normally. Yet I'm troubled about her, for her. Vivian shuns the company of others. Though the fairest maid at court, she keeps men at a distance. I thus determined I would resort to trickery. Trickery? That even befitting of a knight? In war, yes. And what is love if not battle? As it were, one evening I crouched in hiding outside her seamstress's home. As Vivian emerged from it, I too emerged ever so gently but convincingly collided with her, then promptly offered to escort her home. She consented. At first, all augured well. Thanks I proposed for the a more scenic route. She agreed. I made kindly forays into conversation, and she even began to respond as we neared the end of our route. Then suddenly... Then suddenly, mid-speech, from her mouth there flew a most hideous shriek. I stopped stone cold in my tracks while she turned red, then promptly ran off. I did not give chase that time. Hmm. I attempted to approach her on several ensuing occasions to learn what had happened, for I feared she had become entangled in some trouble. I noted that often come night, she ventures into the woods, where I've seen her walk about a glade near a pool. I've striven on occasion to follow her, but lost track each time. It seemed then she'd melted into the air. Huh. Tell me more about Vivian. Who is she? What's her story? She's her enlightened highness's lady in waiting. Her mother was a lady in waiting. Her father, a knight. That is all I've learnt, for the Duquesa grows angry when asked about her. Vivian spends her days within the palace walls. Yet we are in luck, for she has been named a tourney's patroness this year. Thus, each participant will be granted an audience with her. Got a problem then. See, I'm not a participant. I've devised a solution already. You should take my place in the lists and thus gain the chance to speak to her. I was looking forward to winning the tourney, very much so. Yet for Vivian, I am prepared to sacrifice anything. Let's talk about my reward. Hardly a regular job, this. 
Not often I gotta take part in a tourney to fulfill a contract. V can't be anything ordinary either. I have no magnet to command heaps of coin, but naturally I shall award you a just amount. How much do you demand? Ooh, my, my, um, let's just say 640. Vivian is worth every copper, but this amount I simply do not have. You ask too much. I have comrades I can ask. They would surely lend me coin. Yet even that would not be enough. Could you not lower your fees somewhat? Alright, 600 seems reasonable, so... I have comrades I can ask. They okay, not enough. Alright, let's make it a bonus of... 35. Agreed. That is an amount I can indeed muster. All right. Fine, I'll look into it. Gotta admit, piqued my curiosity. I shall be forever in your debt. Now, we must ensure you are not eliminated from the tourney before you can meet Vivian. Meaning? Could you show me how you shoot, ride and fight perchance? And you must learn the tourney rules, know how to apply them in practice. I, I did not mean to suggest I doubt your abilities. Everyone must train, even a witcher. Besides, the tourney contests must surely differ. Require skills you don't usually apply. Races above all. The choice is yours. Where shall we start? Target practice. Marksmanship. I feel a need to do some shooting. Got my crossbow. The marksmanship contest shall pit you against another for the best time and skill. He who hits all his targets first wins. Hope my aim's as good as that Cupid's who shot you. Sometimes when you speak, I miss the meaning entirely. Hmm. Hit the red targets! Hold up, guys. Oh, gosh. I didn't realize I was meant to start shooting. Wrong target. One point for your opponent. Can we try that again? I was too busy riding. Didn't realize I was into something. Once more? Once more. Glad they give it another try. Once more? Alrighty. Done enough shooting. Where to now? If you wish to know my thoughts, were I you, I would train on the race course ahead of all else. Alright. Let's do some riding. Roach will like that. Excellent idea. Roach is probably the best Come horse around. Me. The tourney's race differs from others you might have taken part in. You shall not ride against any opponent. How is it a race at all, then? It's a race against time. The true track begins in the arena, runs round the tourney grounds, then finishes again in the arena. The training track, however, lies beyond the arena. We shall go there now. Each 
Red horse. What nice colours. Keep moving. All is ready. Now listen, for it can be quite a challenge. Along your route stand dummies and targets. The dummies you may cut with your blade, the targets you must hit from your crossbow. The time you have to complete the course shall increase each time you land a strike, be it with blade or bolt. It may sound simple enough, yet I've seen many a knight fail this contest and hang mm. his head in shame. During the race proper, judges throughout the course shall tally your points, for now you may ride unperturbed by those matters. Look at that. Mounted combat. Holding down the aim button will trigger a slow motion mode. So you see how we got these targets here, right? So you come along, swing, or do what I just did there and just not hit. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna mess up so bad. There. It wants me to go back. That's so annoying. Okay, so it adds extra time. We're gonna need to retry this, otherwise I'm gonna mess up. I mean, I did it, but I'll be racing other people. Likely. So, have you had enough, or do you wish to ride again? I'll give it another go. No harm in going again. Practice makes perfect, even for witchers. Okay. We just want to. We just want to gallop. Oh my friggin' gosh, really? Here we go. Got it. That's much better. Perfect. Will you give it another go? I can set up more dummies. Had enough. Rather not wear my horse down before the real race. Where to now? I'm at training. Be nice to swing, do some footwork, work up a sweat. Very well. We shall practice infantry combat one on one. Each knight opts for his own methods. Rainfarn, for instance, fights Halberd in hand. Come with me. You will team with other knights to fight. The clash simulates a true skirmish during battle. Come the end, you shall fight a duel. It will determine your place on the podium. I always liked the duels the best, but now I can think only of my Vivian. In the end, it is good you will replace me. 
I sense I would simply be distracted this time. Keep moving. Stand at the center of the training ground. A knight will approach and challenge you. By my throat, it is the Witcher who The Knight's Codex commands constant improvement. You shall perish, evil dwarf. How long are you going to make me wait? Okay. Apology. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Do, do, do. Finally, apologies, guys. You shall perish, evil dwarf. Cut, slice, smash. Oh, you got me. I'll try again. Do you wish to train more? Could probably use some more practice. Usually fight monsters, not knights. Witcher act always with reason. Alright. I will stand that fight, but be warned, I do nothing halfway. The show us again. How long are you gonna make me wait? This is just there. I expected you to do well, but not that well. I think I've seen enough. Sorry to be blunt, but the simplest Witcher contract demands more skill than this kind of combat. Now you must go to the inscription tent. Honor and glory are all true and good, but your scrolls must be in order. Witcher act always. This is one of my favorite things because you get given quite a lot of cool things from it. 
and it makes me so friggin' happy. You guys are gonna see. And Roach is all armored up. I just wonder if it's, um... Yeah. Look at that, I had the option. I could grab that arm on the right, or I could have the one on the left. Greetings. Want to join the lists? Naturally. We must first see to formalities, however. At Guillaume's request, I have looked into your personal history in its heraldic aspects. Really? What did you come up with? My findings show you may take part as Geralt of Rivia. What a surprise. Or as the Honorable Ravix of Vorhorn. It's not every year we have a combatant who can boast of two crests. Which do you prefer? I want to join as Geralt of Rivia. Yeah. What do you learn about Geralt of Rivia? I'm kinda curious what you could have learned about Geralt of Rivia. In the year 1267, a certain Geralt, a member of the Witches' Guild, was knighted by Queen Meave and dubbed Geralt of Rivia. This was in honor of his distinguished service at the Battle of the Bridge, said structure spanning the Yaruga, but I wager you know of which battle I speak. Hmm. Yeah. Those were the days. Kahir and I led a fistful of Nordlings against an entire Nilfgaardian battalion. Won that battle just because we absolutely had to cross the river. And what about... Ravix of Forhorn? Yeah, Ravix of Forhorn. dig that up. Here in Toussaint, we treat heraldry very seriously. One visit to the Ducal Archives. That is all I needed to acquire the necessary information. Ravix of Forhorn was the name under which you attended a feast honoring Princess Pavetta, daughter of Queen Calanthe of Sintra, on the occasion of her 15th birthday. That's actually right. Huh. I want to join as Geralt of Rivia. I'm Geralt, not about to fight under a false name. You may now take the shields bearing your crest. I'm a witcher. Shields aren't something witchers ever use in combat. Who mentioned using it in combat? Not I. The shield commemorates your participation in the tourney. You may take it as a souvenir. Hmm. In that case, thanks. Have you been instructed as to the tourney's challenges, prizes, and vows? If not, I do hope you will allow me to tell you about them. Um, challenges, tell me about them. Guillaume told me a bit about the contests. Rather make sure I'm clear on them, though. An admirable thirst for knowledge. There are contests three. A shooting range, where you will compete side by side with an opponent. A horse race, during which you will seek to complete the course within a specified time. Any targets hit with bolts or dummies felt with blade will increase the time you have. Finally, the group melee in the arena, crowned with a duel against last year's champion. As each contest ends, its results will be posted on the board outside my tent. This way, all will be apprised of who leads at any given moment. Hmm. Convenient. Yeah, what about the prizes? Didn't yeah, hear about those. Right with it. I'm a sucker for prizes. Yeah, I am too. The winner of each contest shall receive a trophy. Whoever has the best result once all contests have played out shall face last year's champion in a final duel for glory and the title. Should you defeat the reigning champion, the grand prize will be yours. This year, a sword forged especially for this occasion by the one and only Cornelius of Asengard, a famed master weaponsmith. Her illustrious highness had it brought all the way from Nazar. And vows. 
You say something about vows? As is our custom, knights make vows to which they hold for the duration of the tourney. Each swears on something which to him represents his most cherished virtue. I know all I need. Feels like I know everything I'd ever want to know about chivalric tourneys. Yeah, I want to do one now. Splendid. In that case, you must make your vow. Upon what would you like to swear it? <laughs> Why not? I vow on the love of my lady, Yennefer of Vengerberg, to respect the chivalric virtues. May the gods succor you in your endeavors to overcome. Sign here, please, then fill out these forms. That is all I need from you. Now, as arranged by Guillaume, you shall be fitted with appropriate armor for the tourney. Hmm, shiny. You have also been assigned a tent for the tourney's duration. It stands near the arena. Good luck! Look at Geralt with the Sama. Oh, he looks cool. Oh, Geralt. Yep, so we just got the Descent armor, which is better than the Forgotten Wolven armor. Now, I'm not sure if it levels up with you, sadly. I'm going to wear it for now. Look at that. I feel amazing, and especially once we get Erudite. Which we actually haven't done the Virtue yet, that's why we've got to keep doing this. Gosh, Geralt looks so cool now. Looks amazing! Woo! Geralt, it's mixy. Well, be, have you decided to turn Knight Errant? All dressed in the side here on a job. You in the 22? Am I? Ha! I shall square off against Rinfarn of Batrim. I saw him just moments ago, a nervous wreck, stuffing his nose with fish tech, no less, as if that would aid his determination. Guessing that's against the rules. But who's to tell the Nifgardian what to do? Listen, Geralt, I've a tip for you. The timing of your marksmanship duel is such that you shall have the sun in your eyes. Makes no difference to me either way. Nor will it give you any pleasure. Since, as it is, we must both wait, Play me in a round of Gwent. Should you win, I shall swap with you. To me, a Southerner, the sun is no hindrance. Let's play. I want your Gwent guard. Never turn down a round of Gwent. I think I am yet to have turned down a round of Gwent. He's gonna lose. But I love the, the music that they have. It's different for this DLC. Okay, I have Roach, which is pretty cool, but no. Yeah, that's better, and that, that's actually much better, because he summons in Roach. Find a Roach card in your deck and play it instantly. <laughs> that's great. We're really lucky with this. Oh damn it, these controller batteries are low now. Pretty sure these are my last batteries. I might need to get a charger out. This gonna be a, a hindrance though.
Well, I've got my charger now, so... Okay, he's beating me by that much, okay. Really Zoltan. Oh jeez. Okay. Released some of the guns. Okay, that's a real big gun. But he doesn't have roach, but I do. Oh, I can't take Geralt back. Alright. I know what I will do. Take that back and pass. Damn, he's tough. That's useless. But I can revive high powered card here. Whatever the highest is, which is Zoltan. You bastard. Scorch them both! Oh, that doesn't help. But I think I won. Which means I pick up one card, which he doesn't. So, I win. Oh, that was so close. That was so close, I nearly lost. I congratulate you. We shall swap as agreed. We've passed the time not nicely. Lady Fithian should appear forthwith. I'm off to face my first challenge. Good luck. you. The honor and duty of tourney patron have fallen to me this year. Fight honorably so that I may bestow upon one of your number the tourney's grand prize. You have sworn your vows. You have ready body and soul. The time has come to test them. Behold Horm Akispark of the Mechtian Royal Line. His name's quite the mouthful, a true challenge to rhyme. <laughs> His targets to be hit centrally and true are the ones in blue. Against him new blood, a knight unknown till now. Sir Geralt of Riffia, give us a bow. The targets he must with his quarrels thread are red. May the better man win. So we just shoot all the red ones. Only red. We can do this. Like a lava ghostly grasping with one fair teeth, girls half strewn to its joyous victory and bitter defeat. <laughs> that was easy. Hopefully, this doesn't cut me Sir out. Sir Geralt of Rivia has trounced his foe. 
pound at him soundly, immersed him in woe. Your prize, sir. A crossbow adorned with your crest. I congratulate you. Well, thank you. Thank you, my lady. Gerda Rivia's crossbow. My medallion's vibrating strongly. Can only mean one thing. Magic. The explanation is disappointing, I'm afraid. The fragrance I use, it's mixed by a sorceress. To lose to an opponent such as you is a victory of its own. Accept my congratulations as well. Thanks. I'm gonna squat that crossbow. In the interim, I managed to determine which tent Lady Vivian occupies. Perhaps you could find a clue within it. You're right. Vivian's cursed in some way. Sensed it when she opened the tourney. In that case, we've no time to lose. Let us go. Let's do it. Yeah, let's go now. It's a, it's in his quest line. It, we get challenged to a duel, and we accept it, and then win it to prove your honor. This is her tent. You must look inside. Search it. I shall hoot like an owl should someone approach. Okay. Um This is gonna get This is gonna get really annoying with the controller cutting out. I'm sure what beast left them. Just that it's big. The two breasts are like Why is he talking about press? Clothing's all dark green and yellow. Seems Yen's not the only one with a fixed color scheme. Jar of concealing ointment. Powerful magic at work here. Airs and salts. Used to make compresses. Hmm. Someone approaches quickly. You were supposed to hoot. We shall speak later. We must return to the tourney now. It's it's time for the second contest. Sirs, what seeks you in my lady's tent? Inspiration? Be gone from here. Hmm. I can't equip it yet. I gotta be level 31. Can I at least view it? Usually that's an option, like, you know. No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, your preview. No, that's sword. Yeah, no. Why were you in there? Uh, tourney business. Nothing of import. The flower of chivalry. Strapping legs. Got a race now. Please don't cut out on me, controller. I'm drawing us. Behold, gallant knights and ladies decorous, gaze at the host assembled before us. Is that another Look upon person from Rubia? best and most storied. Come from far lands, here to seek glory. Hear now their names as I shout them aloud. Save her the titles of their presence, be proud. Kalmarin, the Baron of Longfall. Leaders of Metina. 
Rinfarn of Atta. Horm Makaspark of Meikt. Dunmir of Troy. Guy de Boisfren in service to the Duchess. Delwyn of Craigiau. Cut tie of Dondal. And say of Lyria and Rivia a prince. Lyria and Rivia. Geralt of Rivia. For Gregoire of Mount Gorgon, let out a roaring cheer. The faint fire of silence, Tony Champion from last year. Today's winner of contests, his victory to secure, shall face a Gregoire in a challenge severe. Does ignorance demand a bard in deceit? Does someone need telling how tourneys proceed? How dare you enter a tourney for nobly born knights? Your knighthood came through the grace of my mother, me, Queen of Lyria and Riffia, whom you treacherously deserted mere days later. Your presence here is an offense to my honor. And yours is an offense to my honor. If you're done, step aside, Prince. The Tony's protector, the mate Vivian. Her beauty enchances both beasts and men. My heart's greetings, dear knights. May my grace guide you and show you the path Apologies, of oh. honor, valor, and glory. Accept Apologies, my wishes of good fortune, sir, and devote all your strength to the tourney, and only it. The time has come for you, Sir Knight. Mount your steed. Swift be your flight. Ladies and gentlemen of lineage illustrious, soon steeds shall swarm like ants most industrious. To beat time's passage, they'll ride like the gale. What a sight to behold, what a lark, what a tale. Before us, Geralt, from Rithia come, fast as the wind, bright as the sun. Alrighty. This is a race. Then we're gonna shoot the target. And he's up! We the thunderous roar, hoofs pounds the ground. No legion of drummers could make such a sound. Oh, this side. Got it. Oh, I missed it. Crap. That's probably what just saved us there. And if I can hit this one. Or not. Oh my gosh, Geralt. He's just swinging to the wrong side. And you missed that target, oh my gosh. Okay. Thank you for hitting that one. <sighs> and if I lose, this is pretty crap. I look like I hit that one.
Oh, that just... Finally, we got one. The sword. Other side, other side, Geralt. Bastard. Flash. Eight. Nine. We just passed it. The wrong such side. Style, such grace, such speed. To watch was a pleasure, a treat indeed. To honor our ancients, praise each fair night. We shall feast from eve till dawn's first light. The finest of wine and food shall be served. If you've blood in your veins, come collect what's deserved. I congratulate you. Here, your price. A saddle adorned with your crest. Many thanks. By the way, my maid saw a man with white hair sneak out of my tent. Did you know who it might have been? No idea. How juvenile. Congratulations on your win. In stellar style, no less. Ah, I no longer regret I was not able to participate. Almost. We must drink to this. Come with me to the feast. We shall await Vivian together. Lead the way. I'm so glad I at least won it still. <laughs> Missed so many. But I thankfully Roach is fast. If Roach wasn't fast, we would have failed. Probably. Thank you, Roach. I... So, given my life. any thoughts on Vivian? Her beauty's striking. That is not what I ask. Still too <laughs> early to say anything I'd be willing to stand behind. Managed to figure one thing out. She uses powerful magic, masking illusions. Do you mean to say she might in truth look different than she seems? Only guessing right now. We've still some time before Vivian arrives. Let us drink. Why not? To Vivian, may you find the means to aid her. To Vivian. Ah, when I first laid eyes on her, I finally understood what all those poems and ballads were trying to say. Love's not poetry alone. Sometimes it's prose, and sometimes it's just plain ugly. You say that only because you do not know Vivian as I do. A life with her would be sweetness itself. Actually, you don't know her all that well either. It's... Her presence at this tourney is an affront to my honor. I demand satisfaction. Head to the nearest brothel then. Oh! Mounted combat in the main arena. I challenge you. Since you insist, I'm all yours. You shall bitterly regret deserting my mother's army once I'm done with you. May the blood that, that I will pause? spill wash away the stain of your cowardice. Let's get this over with. Quick. Three. Two. One. I Go. suck at this, by the way. <laughs> Geralt, you dumbass. Okay. Hold X. Hold X. Remember that. Holding X slows it down. I never got taught that. I should have done that from the beginning. Okay, I hit him there. Damn, you're ugly. <laughs> Damn, you're ugly. Calm down, Roach. Um...
There he is. Both missed. Too late Got to him. Surrender. Boom. For reasons unknown except to them, the gods have chosen to punish me with defeat. But do not think your cowardice will be forgotten. Damn it. You still going on about that? Need to clear this up once and for all. Had to abandon your mother's camp back then because someone else needed my help. Badly. Couldn't refuse them. Didn't want to, in fact. You mean to say you had a secret mission set off to accomplish it, having vowed to tell no one of its nature until you did? Something like that. Minus the vow. And, uh, I'd still rather not divulge the nature of my secret mission. Can you accept that as justification? In agreeing to duel, you proved yourself a true knight. Thus, I accept your word as that of a man of honor. Glad to hear it. Now I got work to do. We got honor. He called me that of a man of honor. Now I think I might cut this episode short specifically sp specifically just because my batteries Yeah Might have to do so Oh my heart swells to behold this beautiful celebration of valor and honor, and to witness you, who embody the chivalric virtues in your lives, strive for greatness. Yet, after a time of combat must come a time of peace and respite. Thus, I invite all who fought in the tourney to this feast held in your, and none others, honor. And should any among you crave solitude, Private tents await you nearby. The group melee shall take place on the morrow. Glory shall be within grasp for each and every one of you. The best among you shall have the honor to face our reigning champion, the famed Grégoire de Gourgon, victor of last year's tourney. Celebrate, make merry, revel as you will. He's big. Yet be mindful of the trial that awaits you tomorrow. Follow her. We shall meet in your tent before your last contest. You must help her. I think we're gonna leave this mission just here for now. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, click the bell icon guys. Links in the description for Twitch and Discord. Cheers and have a good one guys. Peace.